Hey, how's it going folks? ET here with another tutorial. This one is a goodie, but a quickie. We're going to show you how to do a countdown timer just like this. Pretty cool, huh? I just thought of this the other day and I figured, yeah, let's go ahead and do a tutorial for it. So what you're going to need is a piece of video and we're going to do a five second countdown. Okay. So let's start off with a video. We're going to go to the titles. I'm going to look for the centered and drag it here. We're going to shrink the size of it down to one second. All right, let's double click on it. We're going to go over here, highlight. We'll put a five. I'm going to take off the border I'm going to highlight it. I'm going to put I think like 600%. Make it nice and big. There we go. Okay. Now we have it shortened to one second. What you're going to do is highlight it. You're going to do the command key and C or you can right click and copy. That's okay too, but it's easier with a shortcut. Next, you'll move the playhead or the scrubber to right after it. You'll do command key and a V and you'll duplicate that until you get to five. So five, four, three, two, and last one, one. So now what you'll do is go in here and you'll update the, your numbers by double clicking Type in the number and go on to the next one. Two, double click and one. Okay, so now let's go ahead and play that and you'll see the countdown timer. Five, four, three, two, and one. So that's it for the timer part, but we want some kind of sound effects, yeah. Let's go up to audio and you're gonna search for time, T-I-M-E, and let's find a good one. Okay, I think the first one's probably the best one. Let's go ahead and grab that. We'll drag it down right below the video clip. We're not going all the way down to the audio bed. We're gonna go right below the clip here. And I don't want the bing boom, bing boom, bing boom. I want just one of them. So I want that one here. So what you'll do is you'll Click on it and you can right click to split it. Make sure you're only highlighted on the audio here. And we'll do it right after here as well. You don't have to be perfect. You just want to get the majority of that sound. So right click and split. And let's delete the rest of it around it by clicking on it and pressing delete on your keyboard. And now what you're going to do is place this right when the numbers we have a, there's a little bit of a fade on it, right? When it starts to appear is where I'm putting that sound. So you're going to copy this, you hold the command key and the C, or you can right click and copy it as well. That's easier with shortcuts. As I said before, same for number four, move your cursor down, same for number three, same for number two and last number one. Okay. So let's have a quick listen here. And that's the gist of it. Okay, so right here, this is just a basic one, but you can imagine if you wanted to record your own voice to five, four, three, two, one. Or if you had kids or a bunch of people in a room, you can have them go five, four, three, two, one. You know, something like that. So just use your imagination. That's pretty much all, all editing is, is the more you mess around with it, just try a little bit different here, a little bit different there just to make the final product that much better. All right, thanks for watching guys and ladies, and we'll see you when we see you. Peace and aloha.